Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Hyrule Warriors Age of Peace. So, we only have four more levels of the main story left to do for cleanup. So, let's get started with Relentless as a Waterfall. That was a very long loading screen. Okay, well, there's a Korok nearby already. So, let's take a look. Oh, where would it be? A little area back here, but it doesn't seem to be that way. It's beeping more over here. So it might be... It might be somewhere. So I don't know if it's going to be on the bridge. I doubt it, but maybe. Also, it's interesting in the previous battles with the Divine Beasts, like before getting the Divine Beasts, um... Where is this Korok? It shows, uh, the color of the Divine Beast was orange, which means that it wasn't, it wasn't red or blue. So it didn't have any control on, over it. Um, I appear to be going the wrong way for a Korok. But I think, if I'm correct, it's gonna be somewhere over here, actually. Yeah, there it is. Let's grab that. I didn't count how many I needed before I entered the level. That's not good. Um, I wish I could check from the here. Battle log doesn't show you. There's also two treasure chests. I think there are three in here, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, let's head towards the citadel. Since that's where some treasure chests are, and maybe some Koroks, if I'm lucky. These guardians aren't going to be any problem. Because of that, I love that. It's so good. Stasis you. Okay, weak point smash. That should be the end of that one, probably. Yeah, I'm strong enough to defeat these guardians at these at these at these point. At this point, I can defeat them in, with my finishing move, I guess. Oh, there are two fire ones over here. Oh, one of them got shot for me, which is good. Stasis. I'm gonna try and get the treasure chest at the top here, probably. Actually, I don't think I can go in yet. I think then that I should probably go get the chest that's up at the top of this, the world. Probably a better plan than hanging around here. It doesn't... Uh, it might be behind a few things. Maybe. Hopefully it won't be too difficult though. Let me send Link over to there. Zelda, there's a Korok nearby. Of course there is. Good. But where is it? I don't think it's going to be inside the outpost. Let me check outside quickly. Just around the back. Oh, I can't go back there. That's fine. Let's try the other side. Slowly. It does seem to be around here. There, right there, cool. So many Korok seeds now. Let me just do a little bit of this since I don't actually get to do this move very often. Oh, that was really good. That's just a very good move. Also, here comes the boss of this area. This outpost. Let me just go straight through him. Wow, that was a lot easier than it really needed to be. Okay, well, I'm going to leave Zelda over here, I guess. Let's go to Link. Ow. 
Okay, so I think I need to take out this outpost before I can go into the other area with the treasure chest in it. Come on. 100 KOs, that's pretty good. Oh, stasis. Get rid of all of this. And let's get rid of this mm, bokoblin. Oh, again, really? What are you doing? There we go, weak point smash. Now, I don't think that's actually going to open up the way yet. So I think I actually need to... Let me just set Link here so it doesn't... No, there, so it doesn't move. I think I actually have to switch to Riju to actually clean up the rest here. Ow. Stasis? Why did that miss? Why did my stasis not work? I pressed it. Fly rush, thank you. Rishi doesn't seem to be that strong actually at the moment, which is surprising. Just gonna do a whole bunch of that. Nice. Now we can just get rid of it. And I'm gonna go get that other outpost because I don't know how much I need to actually do before I can access places. Zelda, why are you over here? Go way, way down there. Okay. I think this is where I can go up here? No? Okay, it's over here. I'm just getting lost in the area that you shouldn't be getting lost in. Come on. This is a lot of damage though. There's the outpost boss. If I can find it again. Oh my goodness. Let's use our special. That'll be just the easier option. And let's see if this is actually going to allow me to go places that I want to go. How did that miss? Well, not do enough damage, at the very least. There we go. Well, I don't know where I am now, but that's okay. Okay. Support me for his approach. Well, here she comes. <laughs> so, I think that's a pretty good start. Okay. Wow. Unskippable cutscenes. Yay. Right. Now hopefully I'm not going to have trouble hunting down Koroks in the the citadel. Also that's the, the electricity through the wall is um or not through the wall. It's just in the middle of the air. Probably it's supposed to be on that Guardian, but it's not. Well, I can go in here now. So I need to figure out where in here I need to go. I think I, if I go... Oh, that door's locked. Okay, let's get rid of this silver moblin. Because that'll probably open the door, hopefully. There's a lot of... The gate gates are the biggest problem with cleaning up this... Okay, just go through all of you. And let's head this way. Please? Oh no, I have to wait for the Highland Captain to be better. Well, while it's happening, let me go to Zelda and see if I can pick up any signal. Doesn't look like it so far. Maybe over this way? I think I already got one down that way. Please don't teleport me. Indeed. Thank you. I think I got one there already. 
it's possible that I've already got all the Koroks by this point now, but I didn't pay attention at the start, which is a big problem. I think I got all of the ones down here at the very least. So that sends Zelda over to here, just in case. Uh, Riju. Oh, that door's still locked. Why? And even the one that Link's at is still locked. There we go. Weak point smash. Um, please go up the stairs. Thank you. Because there was a croc there that we got. Maybe if I jump down from up here, I can go to that tre treasure chest. Stasis. Thank you. Come on. Got him in the eye. Weak point smash. I don't think I can see the barriers when I'm on a different layer, layer which is annoying. So hopefully, I'm not actually just missing stuff because I can't see if things are open or not. Okay, yeah, that's... I just can't see if that's open or not on the map while I'm on the top layer. Place this. No, too late. It didn't even work, so that's fine. Oh, he's got a thing. Come on. Fly rush, thank you. Very nice. Stasis, maybe? Yes, yes. Nice. That should be the end of him. So let's get rid of him. So our captain is in a tough battle. That's a shame. Because I'm busy. Trying to figure out everything. Oh, please don't... Wall jump. Say sis, please. Thank you. Stop doing that. I want to stay near him. So I can get rid of him. I think I weak point smashed him. Which works. Okay, let's go to the last bit over this way. Okay. Ice Moblin. Probably works for me. No, don't. Wall jump. Stasis, thank you. Just cancel out of stasis so I can do more damage to his weak point gauge. Oh, almost. And there we go, weak point smash. Um, let me see. What's the map looking like? I can go up. I don't think it's going to end. I think it ends when we defeat the Malice Guardians later on. I think. Let me check on Link. Is this open now? Yes, it is. Okay. Finally, we can have a look at that um, chest. So let's go do that. There's a lot of enemies just out here. Well, here's the treasure chest right over here. There's no Koroks nearby, which is good. That just leaves one more treasure chest. Hopefully, probably. Send Link over there. I think Zelda didn't have anything nearby her either, which is good. Okay, this is actually just closed at the moment. So I need to wait for... Do I need to wait for anything? Or is it just going to open? Okay, it's just going to open now. Good. 
Well, let's have a look at the going this way, except it's probably going to pull me back because of cutscenes. Oh, and that's a Korok. That was lucky. Oh. That was just by random chance, by me hitting a crate that I didn't even know was there. Anyway, there's that. Let me look at the map now, and I don't think it's going to change showing me where anything is, so... It appears that we have everything this level now, and if I'm wrong, I'll be back. Oh. Looks like I got everything. Now, let's go... to... Each Step Like Thunder. The only things we need to collect are treasure chests. So... I guess we can take whatever whoever we want. Probably our strongest warriors would be good. And let's just do the regular battle. Let's go. Cool. Now, treasure chests are pretty much fairly scattered. But I think I'll be alright, surprisingly. Also, I'm like seeing this level again. It's it feels like it's been forever since we were first here, but it also feels like it wasn't that long ago at all. Which is a little bit crazy. Anyway, starting off, treasure chest number one right here. Uh, it looks like I need to go this way. I'm trying to get my areas, like my directions right. Oh my gosh, die. Looks like we need to go this way. I'm not sure I'm going to go just playing this to finish because I didn't do well last time. But I can probably just clean up everything without having to worry about everything. Ah, uh, looks like the treasure chest is right here so it doesn't even need to be inside of the key outpost for it. Very nice. Let's see. Where to next? They're all fairly out in the open. Nice hat. Night passed. Where is it? Hang on. This way. I'm going to leave you for now. Let's head over this way. And somewhere back here. Somewhere right there. Here's another chest. The rest are all on the other side of the map now, so let's start running. Oh, did I go up? Yeah, I did go up. That's not good. Now, let's figure out everything. Oh my goodness, don't hurt me. I'm just passing through. I'm pretty sure these are the only two treasure chests that are over here that I need to actually get. Which makes this very simple because I can just get them straight away. So where is it over here? Right there, I can see it. Ancient Battle Axe Plus Plus. Nice. Okay, and the last one, which is right down this way, right next to where we fought Wind Blight, it's just right here. Cool. I will see you after I finish up this mission, now that I've just started it. That is a long mission, oh my goodness. Oh. Anyway, let's look at the next chapter thing then. Hang on, chapter 6. Oh, that was actually the last one of that one, cool, good. The last chapter is just Koroks. So, right, let's start with the Great Plateau, we need 5. Let's go. Okay, here we go. It's probably not going to be too difficult to find the Koroks. I see, there's five, so... And the first one shouldn't be too far away since that was one of the ones we're missing. Oh, come on. Don't go crazy camera, please. Oh. I wonder how many I missed that were right next to some of the chests that I collected. That's the real thing. 
Is what did I miss? Because it's probably fairly easy for me to miss things. I wonder if it's actually up there. Once I actually get up there. Oh, there's one nearby already. Not surprising, and I can see it already. Because it's that rock over there that we need to blow up. Just like that. Four to go. Okay. Let's keep going all the way down here because there could be one, another one down here maybe. Unless I already got it. But I don't really know. This place looks so different. It's crazy. Looks like there isn't anything over here then. So let's just head over to the other outpost and pray keep going. Just gonna quickly blow this up since I can. It's not really hard to take out the skulls or the other bases. Oh, there's another cork nearby. I'm guessing it's outside of the outpost. I'll find out in a second once I take care of this guardian, which shouldn't take too long. As long as there aren't too many guardians, it won't take a million years. Oh, I'm doing some good damage right now. Okay, we can smash. Let's see if we can find it. Now, can I leave this outpost? Don't think so. Oh, is it this barret? Bob the box? Don't think so. It's probably going to be a little bit more obvious than that. Maybe. I think it's actually outside of the outposts, around the edge. Since there is an outer edge. So we have 3,000 rupees now. That's a lot. Considering how much trouble we've had collecting rupees. Okay, so it should be right over here. That's two down. Yes. Hello. Let's find the rest. Also, there's up here that I haven't been up before, I don't think. So I might find something up here. And if I don't, that's fine, I can just go around again. I might even switch to Zelda for ease of everything. Although, can I actually go along this and then go across around? I think I can. So let's do a little bit of this. Oh, and there's a croc nearby as well. It might be inside one of the inner area things. Oh, where would the... Yeah, I think it is even further in. But we can't access there yet, so we're going to have to wait. Probably. I think? Am I wrong? I can, I, can, I can go up here. So maybe it's around... Ooh, beep, beep, beep. It's around here somewhere. But where? It's so close. It's not in here, I don't think. I'm gonna have to check outside again. Oh, hello. Gonna blow you up. It still could be further in, but it's beeping a lot at me right now, so I think it's fairly close. Let's just take a second and hope. There's this box here. Oh, it's of course it's out of the box. That makes so much sense. Three down. Oh, and it's still beeping, but not as much. So it's probably further in that there's another one. Oh, but there's also this one over here. How did I miss so many that were just here? How are we doing? One more to go. Wow. Okay, then. And I don't know where it's going to be, so I might actually be able to just make a cut to wherever I find it. 
since there are still a few more outposts to go claim still before moving on. So yeah, I'm going to do that. Okay, right up here, I'm getting a little beep, so I'm hoping that it's over here and not up the hill. Because it feels like it could be over here. But it... Oh, wait, no. I know for a fact where it is. It is up there. I saw it on a different person's playthrough. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so now that we're in the Shrine of Resurrection, let's just go up this path here. And right here... Where is it? I know it's here. Oh, it might actually be up here. Yeah, it's right up here on the edge of everything we're looking at in the world. It's just the Korok. Right there. So there we go. Just like that. But anyway, that is it for this episode of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.